with the nomination of Vihiga County to host the Miss Tourism Kenya. The rest of the counties were here for the launch. And to show Kenya's prowess in culture, these groups showcased their art of dancing. These women were not ready to be left behind. Then, the Tiriki dance troupe followed with their trademark dance. All this was in readiness for hosting the Miss Tourism pageant. Governor Moses Akaranga is optimistic that the county is up to the task. Hosting the event in Ivhiga will effectively market the county as one of the key tourist attraction destinations in West Circuit. This is because Ivhiga being a rural country, county has a lot to offer in tourism as compared to metropolitan cities in our country. But this nearly screeched to an anticlimax when Hamisi Member of Parliament Charles Gimose said he would vote against the two-thirds gender bill, arguing that emphasis on the girl child has tended to negate the boy child. Even if you have traveled all over the world, the workers are women. The countries have been to, most of the workers are women. But we want to punish you by re rejecting the two-thirds gender rule in Parliament so that the boy child can come up. He, however, urged for the support of women to realize uniform development that ensures everyone is on board. We shall support our women, we shall support our boys, we shall support the governor, we shall support the county, uh, county government and its assembly, and we shall support everybody who has goodwill in this country. Former TV anchor Catherine Kasavuli was nominated the Vihiga Goodwill Ambassador for Miss Tourism. Judith Akolo, Channel 1 News.